I'm Robin from Robin's Wreath Ring. I'm going to show you my new wreath kit using my small cardinal sign. So come on, join me. Let's have some fun. Hey everybody, sorry I didn't make it for my Monday Night Live. I thought I would do a short video on a new wreath kit that I'm offering. Um, this is of a snowflake pine wreath base. You can see from the back. My tip to you is if you purchase the wreath kit, take this outside, shake it really good. They have this snow so covered on here that it just, as soon as you start pulling it apart because it comes real flat, so you have to adjust it and put everything in place. All right, this, um, this is like, gosh, over 25 inches round. All right. But what I liked about this, it's something that's, um, it's just sophisticated. It's just simple. Um, I'm also going to be offering my small when cardinals appear, angels are near sign to go in the middle here. Your kit will come with the sign. It will come with a ribbon. It will come with a cardinal. I would suggest that you find some pine cones if you want to add them. Okay, so you'll be getting all this. You'll also be getting three sprays of berries. Okay, these are not the styrofoam berries that pop when they're out in the weather. These are hard acrylic coated berries. So when you put this on your door, you won't have this pop, the, the red finish pop off and turn to white. All right, so you're going to get your wreath base, your sign, your cardinal, and three berry picks, okay? And then you'll have a choice of whether you want this ribbon to go with it, or if you want this ribbon. Now there are two here. You get a red and black, and then you get the black and white, which really puts some sophistication in the wreath, okay? So you have your choice of those. You also will have your choice of the shiny red berries or the, um, and these I guess you would call metallic red berries. So you'll either have your choice of the metallic red berries or the plain, I'll say cherry red berries. Okay, so here's the metallic and here's the cherry. This just has an extra iridescent to it, okay? So you get three picks, your sign, the wreath base, and the ribbon. So you'll need to tell me whether you want the hound's tooth with the red and black, or you just want the red and black that has the fuzzy on the end. When you have something that's low profile like this, real simple, you don't want to add a whole bunch of stuff to this. You just want to keep it simple. Okay, so your sign is going to go in the middle. Now these wreath kits are going to be $29 plus shipping. And it, like I said, it will come flat, fold it up. You'll have to open it up and spread everything out. And because it's so flocked, flocked really well, this is something you'll want to uh, go ahead and flock outside. And you tell me where you want your um, holes for your sign. I can do all four corners. I can do two corners. I can do a top and bottom. That's going to be your choice. This was actually the one we at, we used on the um, embroidery base the other day. I just borrowed it for today for the design. Okay. So you've got your sign in the middle. Then you're going to take these. Now you can, if you want, take these apart, okay, and spread them throughout. I myself don't want to do that. I just want to put them in various places. But I am going to spread it out and kind of like twist it around the branches. That's what's nice. These branches are all, um, they have the the metal in them so you can spread them around. I just wanted to keep it really simple. 
because um, I have somebody that is interested in this wreath and they like simple. All right, so there's your first pick. Then you take your third one. Now, depending on where you're going to put your ribbon, you might want to cluster these all together, put your ribbon here, or you might want to go across. This has five points on it, so you want to keep that in mind. I'm going to put this one in here. And I'm going to, like I said, wrap it around some of the branches just to kind of make it look like it's in there. Okay. And I think for the third one, let me turn it around and see. I think I'm going to go up here with it. Or I could choose to put my cardinal up there and put this one. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put my cardinal up here and put this one down here. And it's real easy. You could just glue these right in here underneath the sign. And like I said, this will not come with the pine cones. I could not find any, so I adjusted the price of the wreath piece. All right. And let's clip our cardinal up here. Actually, I want them closer. And see, I can bend my, my branch to kind of have him sitting up there there we go okay now this one here i use seven seven loops and they are like four inch loops and then i took a three inch loop bow and i placed it on top so that's your one choice okay and like i said these really look pretty kind of just scattered around in here. So this is something that you yourself could find and kind of tuck in there. It just kind of pulls some of the wood out of the sign and gives you a little woody feel to it. Okay. Or there's this ribbon that's available. Now I'll show you how to go ahead and make this. There are only four of these kits available. So if they sell out, if the demand is high and, and you didn't get one and you want one, um, just let me know and I will see if I can get more. I know I have more ribbon. It's just whether I can get the wreath base or not. So all I did was make like about a four inch loop. Okay. And two tails. So I'm going to use my tinsel tie. It will come with tinsel tie for your bow. I just wanted something that looked classic. Classic and sophisticated. Simple. If this has gone up north where people have uh, their screen doors, no problem. This will fit perfect in between there. If this is something they want to decorate inside the house with, It'll, it'll fit nicely on the wall, no problem. Okay, so let's put our bow on here. Just classic and sophisticated. And again, you don't have to do your wreath the way I did mine. You might have another idea, but this was the one that I chose to go with. And Cindy Anderson Parton, is that how you say it, that um, shared her bow for the bow contest. Um, she had the lantern with the bow on top. You are the winner of the welcome sign. So make sure that I get your address. You could decorate this with balls. You could get really crazy with this. 
Now let's see if I can just sit that in there so you can see it. Okay, there we go. Simple, easy peasy, great gift for somebody that just lost a loved one or, you know, is suffering from a loss because angel or uh, cardinals are associated with angels. So there you go. You get your choice of that ribbon or you get your choice of this ribbon. And just for visual purposes, I'll put it on there for you. You get three berry sprays, a cardinal, and the cardinal sign. There. So you get your choice of ribbon. And like I said, there's only four available at this time. So if you want one, now's the time to get one. All right, this is Tuesday. Um, look for me tomorrow on Wednesday. We, um, we got our CNC machine, small one. We're starting out small until my son can build the bigger one. Um, so we're really excited. I'm hoping to have my latest project finished by tomorrow for tomorrow's design. So stay tuned. All right, have a great evening and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.